And we're live. Let's check this out. Everything's all right. Everything's all right. Welcome back, everyone, to my channel. Welcome back to What Lies Beyond Existence. And welcome back to the return of Sunday Stream. So, guys, a couple of things. First, I don't think the internet will go down today. Mainly because I bought uh, an Ethernet cable, connected it to the router, and everything seems stable, everything seems fine. So, that's the order of business number one for today. Order of business number two. I went back and basically made like a big search around the internet to find something that, well, that would change the crappy guitar tone that we had the other day. And I more or less did it. Again, everything's free. I had to work with what we have. And I actually found some nice plugins making like a, a big wider search. Actually, actually helped not only the guitars, but pretty much every other, every other instance of, uh, of different plugins. So, without further ado, previously on the Cradle of Guilt, we basically, I showed you what I had. We changed a little bit like the, the piano here, but it, it will be, it will be changed again. Um, and we, as I was saying, we weren't happy with the sound that we've had, that we had basically because of the guitars. Now, if you look down here at the mix, at the mix uh, part of the plugin, well, of the DAW, I don't know what it's called, it just says mix here. If you look here at the guitar rhythm, you notice that I have uh, five plugins connected and another three here. Basically because, like a big dum-dum that I am, I forgot that you could actually put Emissary, which is a head amp, and an impulse response, in this case two, on the on whichever plugin you've had here, just to distort the sound and try to emulate a better guitar. So the guitar that we had the other day, Anita, Anita 1960. Welcome, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> so, as I was saying, um, yeah, <laughs> as I was saying, um, this Ant Man Ryu, <laughs> I know who you are. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, too. Thank you, guys. We need to behave by the looks of it. My parents are here. <laughs> so I, need to, I need I need to be on my best behavior. Okay, as I was saying. Um Emissary and Nadir. Actually an impulse response and a hand pad. Basically a full on amp over in this specific case a full strat version of um of, uh, what's this program program called? Uh, this is Presence. So, I had a Presence here. Yeah, see, if I turn all the plugins down. This, greetings matey, greetings. Greetings to you too, welcome back, welcome here, welcome to the channel. Um, yeah, this was the sound that we have which is not a good sound. So what I did was I doubled it. I found another plugin called Grind Machine that will distort the sound. And I'm going to turn it off and on. I'm going to turn it all on one at a time so you can see the difference. This is what we have. Let's solo this track. This is what we have only with the presence turned on. So, not that appealing. Double turned on. A little bit more distortion and the sound goes poof. Opens up a little bit. 
You see what I did there? <laughs> I did see what you did there. <laughs> so. <laughs> God. Um, so, this plugin just opens the sound, okay, sends it to the sides a little bit. You go away. Sends it to the sound a little to the sides a little bit, and then I turn on grind machine, which is basically a, a full on amp. It will distort the sound completely. So it does this. So lots of distortion. I just I messed around with it, and this is more or less okay. And then basically uh, a bass overdrive that I'm using on the guitar and. Yeah, it works. So right now, this is what we have. So, big sound, big beefy sound. This is what we had. So, big difference. Again, it's nothing spectacular, but works. It's, it's not completely inaudible. And I now can work with, uh, distortion, with the distorted guitars. Um, uh, with the distorted guitars, uh, without having my having a, a guilt trip to make you guys listen to it. So, yeah, I did that on the guitar solo. Uh, on the other hand, I didn't use emissary or an impulse response uh, on the rhythm guitars, but I did use it on the solo. So this is what we had. Doubler on, impulse response, and emissary. So now, now it seems like it's connected onto the uh, an electric onto onto the electricity. So it's it's an electric instrument now. now. Now you can hear it. Again, not perfect, but this is what we have right now. I also changed the violins because I found this, which is more or less okay. I like it. And it's one violin only, which is what I was looking for. I'm gonna need to change... Ah, I changed the voice too. So you hear, it's not perfect, but now I don't mind it that much. I'm, it's gonna change either way, but now we can work with it and not be not be bothered by the sound. Hey, Realtor, what's up? What's up, man? Welcome back to the Sunday stream. Yeah, it's back on. So, couple of changes. The piano wasn't... The piano on the voice, I, I had to change it because the one that we were using, I, I think we were using the piccolo, right? Yeah, the piccolo, the piccolo wasn't working for me. It's, it's just too pretty here, and here it's just annoying. So I changed it, I put the piano. However, I did... I did found... No, as far as I don't know. I did found uh, a couple of Virgin Choir. I, I think this, is one, this was one of those. Let's see. Replace. Yeah, I, I found a choir and something that... Wait, what? what's this? Following plugins did not work as expected. No. So I guess we're not going to use that. Because reasons. Uh, Sonatina Orchestra. I think it also has a choir. So let's try this one. Replace. Cannot find the instruments. Because I didn't put them on. Eh. But you, I can... Uh, but it will make... Uh, how am I gonna... Ah, I know how I'm gonna do it. Uh, okay. But you, I can just... You, I know what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna come here, I'm gonna come here. It's gonna be quite fast, so don't mind it at all. Um, here. Let's... 
cut it, come here, here, VSD, begins, and paste it. Go, continue. And now it's going to change there. Um, yeah. While that passes on to the other side, what other changes did I do? It's already passed. Cool. Let's see if now it automatically reads. I don't think so. Load. Cannot find instruments. Uh, it does need to... Other day. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna gonna redo it again because I have yet another choir and this one is from labs yeah I downloaded a couple of and by a couple I mean at least three or four <laughs> different diff different choirs so yeah vocals long no 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 piano synth Is this the only choir I have? I think I had more. I think I had more. It was in labs. Yeah, they're all here. Cello, violin. As you can see, I have a lot more um, harmonic cello, a lot more instruments, a lot more virtual instruments, because yeah, I was, I'm kind of a trigger happy when, when the, the, the order of business is plugins. I like plugins a lot. So yeah, let's load you. I think you already, I already have. It wasn't symphonic orchestra. Something else. It wasn't. I think. I think it really was labs. It had choir. I don't think it's you. It doesn't make sense that it was you. Yeah. No. So every single. Every single instrument that I download from that, I need to restart. But I'm not gonna restart because I'm a stubborn. I don't think it has. So here, this is another one. Sforzando. Uh, let's go for here. Let's import. Yeah. Let's see if this works. This is another one. Uh, menu. Nope. Here. Plugins. And it's this one. So. Keys, bass, cello, flute. Where's the choir? Come on, don't tell me it doesn't have a choir. <laughs> it's a lots of in lot, lots and lots of instruments, and it doesn't have a choir. Let's see if you guys can see it. Miscellanea raw, miscellane, alien sirens. Well, Glockenspiel. It's like that. Um, tubas. Well. Percussion, strings, solo violin. Yeah, it has another one. Oh boy, bassoon. Well, lots and lots of instruments. I don't know if they're good or not, because as you can see, lots of them. And I didn't. Uh, I download them, and yeah, I download it. And um, strings ensemble. No. Uh, timpani, trombone, tubular. Ooh, tubular bells. Cool, 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 cool. This is gonna be useful. Um, yeah, no, lots of instruments and no choirs. Damn it, I downloaded lots of choirs and neither works. Awesome. So yeah, no choirs today, guys. 
there's gonna be two quarries two quarries on uh Tuesday when you get back. So not that worry about it. I have them. It's just a matter of restarting Studio One and I'm being stubborn. I don't want to restart it. Uh this is yeah, this is from VR Harmonic. I think I told you guys that I wanted to I wanted to try uh VR Harmonic's Bohemian Bohemian violin. Well, I don't have Bohemian vi violin. I have the second best thing, which is a violin freebie with only staccato and spiccato from violins from that same orchestra. However, I'm not using it now. I'm using in the violin in, in sustain legato, so it's it's not it's not useful right now. However, it's a pretty nice orchestra from what I did here. Man, Virgin Choir. Yeah. Yeah, I need to check you out. Doesn't matter. Uh, we'll keep a piano there just because it's easier. So let's find a piano that doesn't take presence. Presence. Let's find a piano that doesn't hoggle our. Rock Rand, I think this one doesn't toggle our RAM, so there, it's what it was. There, it's simple, it's neutral. The piccolo was was bothering me here when it goes to these parts here. I didn't like it, so I changed it to a piano. It's gonna be a piano, so. For now, at least until I have the choirs, and then the choirs will mimic the voice. Uh, let's keep calling it Vox Guide so we know what it is. Like we did last song, as soon as we have the voice, this one disappears. This is going to be changed. This is going to be changed. The violin needs to be worked on. Uh, this is going to change because I'm going to record the guitars also. And the piano. Which piano do I I'm using? Oh, this one. Okay. Uh, the piano is going to change too. Basically, everything's going to change. Now I'm just composing to know what is going on on the song. And, like I did last time, uh, what we are going to do is we're going to build the rest of the song. This part here and this part here. As soon as we have the guitar completely done, We'll pass on to other instruments, and the next one is going to be the bass. Not only because the guitar is already done and the bass, it's easier to compose when the guitar is done, but also because it will help this plugin sound a little bit better. Because right now, while I don't mind when it's in power chords, like this, I do mind when it's in riff mode, which sounds a little less stellar. Let's call it. See? Not not that very guitar-like. It's distorted and yeah, that's it. It's noise. Tuned noise, basically. And here, I don't like it either. But here I don't like it either. Because it's it's too much distortion. It will sound different. Because there's no palm mute. I cannot add palm mute here. So it, it lacks that lacks that uh, feeling. However, this one this one I'm gonna change. It's bothering me. It sounds way too eight beat for my taste. But what am I gonna change? Let's hear it. Put it in solo. I think I've downloaded something that might help. Uh, Spitfire. I'm using a lot of Spitfire. Spitfire is awesome. It has just one thing that's bothering me, which is the sound. It's always... the sound is always way too low. Here. Uh, synth. Yeah. Bye. 
See? The sound's always way too low. Let's go with Alien. the guitar then doesn't have any dynamics it's always and it's always the same thing no dynamics but it's what we have and then I turn it down doesn't mind doesn't matter now this is more or less okay so eh, it's everything more or less okay it's not pretty it's the beginning of something so let's take it so this is the second part. Okay. And there's a chorus here. Okay. Where's the chorus here? If I'm looking at this correctly, it's gonna be here. Okay. So, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut this here. Cut this here. U, control C. And here, control V. There you go. Wait, what have I done? Redo and control X. Weird. Did I change it? Yeah, I changed this. Damn it. <sighs> Got it. Okay. of piano, you were synth, alien load. There. You're, getting, you're gonna get annoying quite fast. Here. It's right here. And you're right here. Again, control C. Control V. There. And like this. Okay, how long does it take until it until it gets in? 
till the chorus gets in. So this one goes for ooh, full measure. And damn, almost two full measures. Okay, let's go with this. So like this, right? I can extend you here. Right there. And you, I can also extend you. Let's see. way too big. Yeah, it's way too big. Come on. What am I doing? I'm saying it's almost two measures and then I completely break it. Right there, right. Yeah. It's here. And this so it's gonna be right there. You, on the other hand, I need you to I can actually do it like this. This isn't pretty. This is copy paste basically and measuring things out. Let's see. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so two choruses, one right here, one right here. What do you do? Ah, it's control B, not control. Okay. Um, hmm. With this done, I can work on the guitar. And what will I gonna do to do? It wasn't this what I wanna do. I just wanted to merge events. Oh, uh, the G. I did control G. Okay, doesn't matter. Live and learn. This one goes to here. It's pissing me off a little bit. Okay. Now, what are we going to do? I think instead of starting here, I think I'm going to try to connect these two. And because here I have more or less of a road. The road's more or less um, shown to me. I already did it. Here, because on the other side there's going to be a solo, here I want uh, something that connects to this part here. I 
think I'm going to change this reef, but there's going to be a reef here. So I think I'm going to need something that connects, connects there. Yeah, because I'm going to, I think I'm going to put a, a guitar with a violin on top. So the violin is going to do something. Not not a, a violin solo, but uh, probably but probably a, a violin melody, something that something that I don't know carries it around. It's a it's a violin melody, not a not a solo. Here's gonna be a guitar solo. Here's gonna be a different thing. So. So I mean, see, I'm gonna need you, and you can go up. So, let's see. What can we do? Something like that. Okay. Sure. So from this us to F to D. Kinda dark, kinda heavy. You need to hold on a little bit. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, so from here, um, nope, from here I'm gonna W and um, you're going to A sus, you'll come What? What did I say? So you won't move, you will come to a sus and you go to C. Okay. Mm. 
you know, my tendency, and, and th that's how, that's how it went the other day, the, the other time. My tendency is to go straight onto Berlin's "Take My Breath Away." It's it's more or less, and, and I want to get away from that. Dun, 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 Yeah, I'll keep on going. Up. I'll keep on coming down, and it's easier. Keep on coming down. No. Like this. Uh, yeah. And an A. And this is like what? More or less two bars. Yeah, it ended here. So I did D sharp to D to C to A sharp. Okay. Start streaming. You're about to go live. It's in shop. Hmm? You're about to go live. Dodgehive.com. It's in shop. I, I think it's. Hmm. It's it's. Florix thirteen. Uh, I see what what you're doing, but. It's it's. I, I I don't I don't think I. I enjoy I I don't think it's a cool thing to go to other people's streams advertising your own stream man. That's. Mm, I I don't mind if people want to go there, but coming to other people's streams advertising your own stream, eh. I'm gonna leave it there if people want to see it, but eh. it's it's kind of it, it's not a good vibe, you know. But well, okay. Half a tone, then full tone, and then another full. Okay. Let, let's see how it sounds. Too late. Yeah, it's too late. It's I need to listen again, sorry guys. It, I think it's too late. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. And and um, yeah. and now I think I'm going to make the transition. This is, I think, more than enough to. I think it's more than enough to of a, of a violin melody right here.
just a little bit it will probably it will probably start somewhere in here melody and boom back to the pre-chorus back to the pre-chorus and the guitar riff so and let's see I'm gonna make it better. Yeah, like this, like this, and let's see if it connects. Let's see how it goes. I'm gonna leave it like that. It's not... If I turn it off, this off, and if you listen solely to the guitars, I don't think it's that smooth of a transition. I don't think that's, that's, the, that's the smoothest transition ever. But I'm going to wait until I have more, more instruments and see if, well, and, and see if it gets there. Simple as that. It might get there, it might not. You'll see. I remember that I did something, which is right here. I wasn't smart enough to... Instead of doing this, I'm just gonna boom. You come here, control V, and because I did everything except this part. So I'm gonna do this part. I'm gonna align you. You're aligned. Hmm. <laughs> it's more or less like this. I'm going to leave it. Right? Here, that little transition, it happened there. Also, so this needs to be aligned with that transition right here. There, there. So now. And yeah, so hopefully this is fine now. Here though, here, here, here. What am I gonna do here? Let's create something here that goes from here to there. Hmm. What am I going to create here? It doesn't need to be that long. What? Four bars? 
a four bar solo. It's gonna be me that's gonna play it, so probably <laughs> four bar solo is way too long for what I can do in a guitar. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Um, we're gonna do it live, and I'm gonna take a thousand takes to record whatever the hell I'm gonna write here. Not this part, this part is gonna be the rhythm. So, let's see. What are we doing here? We come from uh, G sharp, F, G, A sharp, G sharp, F. I don't even know. Ah, but I do have, I do have some notes that I did after the that I put down after the... Ah, but it doesn't say anything at all. Cool, cool. Just some BPMs and things like that. Usually I take some notes so I don't forget what I'm doing. Here, it seems I did forget. Uh, but here, I think this is the part that... It's gonna be guitar solo. I have this part here, right in the beginning. The, the weird part that I told you guys about. That you hear, that it doesn't sound that good that weird part right here which is weird it doesn't have any connection it comes and then goes out I don't know which scale I'm using here but this one I think it's Phrygian it's a Phrygian scale and I don't use Phrygian anywhere else on this song so I think I'm gonna use it again I just need to remind myself what's the Frisian scale and to remind myself I'm gonna use internet <laughs> because usually it's the type of things that I forgot or I forget so you come here let's see Frisian scale bring me a picture Okay, so the piano, there you go. So what, what's the thing? The thing here is, okay, so uh, yeah, it's a minor second. And that's it. Starting from A has a minor second, and then a minor third, minor second, and minor third. Okay, minor sixth. Okay, can work with this. Sure. So let's work around with this. Sorry, but that's the extent of my ability to to remember scales coping the internet and coping it around coping it around so okay so how am i going to how am i going to pass from this last note Usually I like the, 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 the solos to shoot through the roof. So if... And start like with a high note and work around that high note. So... Yeah, it's not gonna start here. It's gonna start here. I don't want this song, this note to be that why am i doing this i can just come here and boom do this yeah easy um yeah i don't want that note to be that long yeah right here a bar and change because the voice will be 
the voice will key will sustain this note a little bit further, but the guitar will start sooner. As well as the guitar solo. So both guitars will start sooner. The cradle of guilt. No. How is it? And I don't remember the verses, but I did something. I actually put the song here. Song information. With the lyrics. Ha! Huh. But I didn't save. Cool, cool. Doesn't matter. The lyrics, I... I put it there, but I was exper experimenting some things on, on the door. Uh, earlier this morning and it, there was something that that uh, that changed some of the some of the settings I had so I had to restart from a previous version just to just to be safe so it didn't save the lyrics which I had however I read the lyrics and I'm gonna change a couple of things and by a couple I mean at least half of the of the lyrics so eh. I, it, it, you guys don't need to see it. It's it's too bad. It's a little bit bad. The the chorus, for example, I'm gonna change it all. I don't like it all. However, this last part of it, I don't. I'm not gonna change. In the cradle of guilt, I'll write in blood my name. A symphony in black breaks the dawn upon a new day. Yeah, it's right. The cradle of guilt, I write in blood my name. A symphony in black breaks the dawn upon a new day. So, symphony in black breaks the dawn upon a new day. Day. Symphony in black breaks the dawn upon a new day. day. Okay. So it's going to be in a sharp, the note that will come off of it. So we're going for the A sharp right here. I'm going to put you down. Let's see if it doesn't. Yeah, but it, it cannot be this late. Simple things. So from A sharp. How am I going to do this? I think here I'm going to use the A sharp as the first. And I'm going to the fourth, which in this case is here, second sharp, third, fourth, right? Second sharp, third, fourth. And from the fourth, I'm going to the one, four, six to keep on the to keep on the To, so it doesn't resolve. So the sixth will be this is fourth, fifth, sixth. And the sixth will come to the second because that's the, the main tone of the Phrygian scale. It's that, that uh, minor second that creates the, the, the Phrygian scale, the, the, Phrygian's fla the Phrygian flavor. So, it's in the solo, 
Oh, damn. What have I done? What have I done? Here. Now, this is more or less the sound I want to... This is more or less the sound I want to do. However, I don't know if the the tempo is what I want to do. So there are some things that I want to do. There are some things that I don't want to do. Now, which ones am I going to keep? I don't think I'm going to keep this. This tempo. Not, not the tempo, but the time signature. It needs to be more dun 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 Yeah, I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna need to create some interest here. Right now it's not interesting. Interesting, it's boring. So it will end in an A. I don't need to be to have this A here. So we're gonna create we're going to create something. The chorus is mid-tempo. The chorus is mid-tempo. I think I'm going to accelerate. Hey, but me playing fast guitar solos. Yeah. We'll see what we can do back there. Now, I think I'm going to accelerate it a little bit because here it goes low. So I've told you guys that I like that I like my my songs and the things I write to be a response to what I did previously and if this is more or less mid-tempo I don't know, I don't know the, what I'm gonna do with the drums yet however it's mid-tempo, it's not a ballad so this I'm going I have I think I want to have some something faster here. Can it I don't think I, I like this. Let's go to the third. The minor third. Yeah, see? More... There, it has a more dissonant feel to it. Everything has lots of melodies, and the, the solo here probably is going to be a fast melody, not big solo. I'm not a shredder, like at all. So, yeah, it's probably going to be something more melodic, something melodic fast. I'm a singer, so that's what I write. I don't write solos. I like I write melodies and fast melodies and with a scale <laughs> somewhere in the middle. And yeah. Here, instead of this, I think I'm gonna... I'm gonna divide it. You can be here. But you... Let's do it like this. Yep. Okay. It sounds more like something. Now let's create let's create some dynamics here. Yeah, I'm gonna need to divide this by. 
let's see. You are gonna be divided here. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, like this. Okay. You go to here. You're in G. Wait, what have I done? Did I do here? What's this? Go away, go away. Go away. You. The third right here. Let's see. Um, you're in G. So, right here. Something here that isn't sounding that good to me. And now we double it and make it. So, G. And you, I think I'm going to change. Wait. Where were you? Yeah, you're D sharp. D sharp, so you're coming to B and you're coming to D sharp. And it will make the same. Let's see. Nah, don't like it. Go back. And go back to B. Wait. Well, it's not pretty, but works. Works, you'll be coming here, not D2. Something. 
and goes off. They're off. And in which note do I start here? And let's see if we can this and okay it's an A which if I remember correctly it's exactly where we are no it the Frisian goes to an A sharp and I'm gonna make it go to an A. And, uh, yeah, I think I know what I'm gonna do. Okay. I'm gonna make the connection right there. That's it. The connection is gonna be the A power chord. Here it's an A sharp. It will end in an A sharp. And yeah, that's it. Q, however, gonna need to. I'm gonna make it like this because that may be something that I need to change. You guys, let's all go together, shall we? Okay. They're way too high. Probably I was the one <laughs> way too low. Easy fix. It's an easy fix, but I think I'm going to fix it somewhere else. Let's see. Keep in mind though, guys, this here will not represent the, the, the tuning of the guitar. This, I know it's way too low. I only have a six string, six string guitar. It's not seven string. So probably I cannot do this A1 here. It's, it's way too low. However, this is the sound that this plugin and all the effects I have allow me to do. If I put it up, it will start like a 
a saw machine or something like that, like a saw. It, it, it's not that appealing to the ears. So I'm putting it down so it gets beefy instead of annoying. However, when I when I'm doing it on the guitar, it will be hopefully more pleasant than this. So I'm doing it here just for me to know how it sounds, because once it once I record the guitars all of this won't matter at all right now i'm just looking at the big picture like i told you the other day i'm looking at the forest not the trees it's to see what works if the comp the composition is that well planned or not that's it it's all about the composition not about how it sounds how it sounds will come later Right now, I want to see how the structure of it all works. to make you go on to What if, what if, what if, what if you Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun. So it needs to be faster. like it. Okay. 
and do the time time needs to yep. no the time needs to be here no why did But see, here's the thing. I can just extend this note here, this G. And I can extend it until uh, C my fade out. But that's so cliche. That's, that's basically me just saying, I don't want to think about it anymore. And do something just because. But right now... Because this, because this here, this here, this tempo here, this tempo change, basically, well, changes the tempo. It's, it's not only just changing the tempo. It's not only just changing the tempo that's messing me up. It's I, I don't like the transition. I don't like the transition. And I don't like it. And here's the thing. I don't like it if it's because it's boring. Or if it's because I don't have the other instruments. Because here's the thing. I've told you this guy, I've told you this already, and I'll keep it, I'll keep saying it. If I turn everything special, then nothing is special. That's it. I'm not turning everything, everything, every single instrument needs to be super interesting. Every single instrument doesn't need to be super interesting. Sometimes it's there just to accompany the song, just to help carrying the song from a place to another. That's it. It doesn't need to be oh so interesting. Sometimes it just needs to be there, just or, or giving body or uh, helping the rhythm or doing something. Here, for example, this rhythm guitar, that's it. It's, it's a rhythm guitar. I can make the riff more or less interesting, but your ears will, will be listening to the solo. And don't forget, this is going to be orchestrated. It's, there's going to be a whole orchestra behind it. Not every single time, but most of the times, yeah, there's going to be a whole, whole orchestra. Most of what you'll hear solo will be the guitars, will be the keyboards, will be the violin, will be the voice, of course. A cello, that's it. All the other instruments in an orchestra will be there just to not to create a hall of sound, a wall of sound, but uh, to create, to give a little nudge, a little push, just to be there giving color. This. I don't like this note at all. I need a note because it resolves quite well onto A. but it doesn't I don't 
like the descent. Do something different. Let's see. But what? Okay, I don't mind this transition now. the transition now I still don't mind the tempo change we'll be working on it but now I want to solve this because I have here an A sharp which already there was already it was already marked here but there's nothing si signaling signaling foreshadowing the appearance of this C there's a C-sharp here, let's see if it works like this, probably not, but let's see. Okay, it actually, it's not that bad actually. You, I don't want you that high. Let's see if I can put another C here. No, it changes the impact in there. I need to have you really there. An F. I'm going to keep it like this. There's no reason to keep on beating a dead horse. So, in this, despite not being on purpose, well, it kind of is. See what the song is doing. It's wave-like. If, if you just look at the forest and not the trees, this is what he's doing. It's a wave. 
that's what I want. And it just goes up and down and up and down. It's it's a voyage. It's it's a story. It has ups and downs. And despite not doing it on purpose, I mean, I'm not obsessed in being like super far away and see if it's a big wave that's there. I'm just composing right here. Just checking the notes. Usually most of the time I'm like here, like this. Checking the notes, checking if I'm doing it right. And that's it. And it's like, it's good when I say to myself and, and I, s I actually say it out loud that I like my, my song to react to, to itself. So the fast part will react to the slower parts and vice versa. And it's, it's actually quite awesome when I work according to my ear and when I just zoom out, I see the wave. That's it. That's what I want. So, okay, cool. I don't think I can, I can ever play in a guitar this C sharp here, this C sharp one. It's the lower I get. No, it's actually not. I have a C1. Yeah, that's not, that's not gonna happen. But in the guitars, in the, um, in the guitar, it will probably it it won't make this wave. It will be more more flat lined because I only have six six strings. It's a six string guitar. Right now, I'm more or less happy with this because I've connected one part of the song to the other. That's what I was looking for. bars again. Yeah, I'm gonna change that note. I don't like that C. Okay, you're not that bad, but where's the C? The big one. That C here. I don't like it here. It doesn't sound good. Thing is, I don't know what I'm going to do here. It needs to make sense, and it wasn't making sense. Does it make more sense now? Let me not look at it and see. I don't mind it. I don't mind it that much. Next session, I'll probably hear it with fresh ears and hopefully, and hopefully it will be, it will be all right. Hopefully it won't hurt me. If it does, we'll change it. With fresher ears, it's always simpler. You. But I'm gonna need to change you too, right? It's 145. Oh, Let's see. Now it's just an eye. 
145. So where is it? What's right here? So the 145, dude, come here. Where's the, oh, cool, didn't change it. Where is it? Right here, is it? That's it. That's it, guys. That's it. I thank the guitar for now because it will suffer readjustments, of course, as always. Well, you don't know if it's as always. I just started streaming. But usually it is. This is a sketch. If I, I I don't know if there's anyone there that has any any notions of a uh, illustration or uh, or painting or something. Usually, and and I, I dwelled a little bit on on animation on illustration, not animation. Usually, when you do something, you start with a sketch, right? That's it. You you create the you create like if you if you're painting for example a, a city you start with rectangles and that's it you you start messing it around and creating shapes and that's what this is it's the shapes I, I want to see how it all speaks to each other I'm not a fast composer obviously but this is how I do things and this is how I like to do things. I want to create it all, see if it works, mess around with it if I don't like something and that's it. Right now, I want to see if the, sh if the shapes work. As soon as I'm happy with how the shapes are, then I go deep and I change notes and I change dynamics and I change things. But the main skeleton, the main uh, spine of the song is done. So this is the shapes. Well, if I was too fast, it wouldn't be, well, it, it would be better streaming probably for you guys, but there are guys faster than me. Those guys are doing that already. I actually like being, <laughs> being completely noob in, in this because if, if you're starting something, if you're learning, how to do things, you'll probably be like me. That's it. Most of the guys that are starting to compose, starting to create, and if they're on my level or below, or even one or two level, levels higher, will be as fast as I am right now, doing how, how I'm doing it. I have a keyboard and a mouse, and that's how I'm composing the guitars. But I want to. And because I want to, I work with what I have. And this is what I have. I have a guitar there. But I'm not a guitar player. Or at least a, a very good one. So this is faster for me. I'll compose it like this. And now I know. This is all power chords. I know that I'm going to change from G to F to A sharp to G sharp to G to F to A sharp to G. And 
It's easy. Now I know what I have to do. It's, it's, it's faster. It's composition wise, it's faster. If I was on a guitar, I'll, I'll learn it faster on a guitar because now I know what I'm going to do. And yeah, that's how I compose. And well, I'm sure people won't like it, but I'm pretty sure there are guys like me that want to start, don't know how to, and this might help. And I really hope it does help because this is how I do it. And eventually if you're starting something and you want to evolve, you'll probably find your own way then. But now you know how I do it and you have a starting point. You can start uh, copying the, my mechanisms and eventually grow from there, from there. You'll probably, you'll probably see that you don't like to compose the guitars the way I do. And it's completely fine. You can go ahead and find your own ways. That's it. That's the point. Now, guys, for today, for the Sunday stream, it's... I think it's it. The internet stabilized on the green, which means the cable worked. Happy with that too. Not happy of having like a big cable on the floor and having to to roll it and put it away every single stream. But now I know it works. It had to. I mean, the other the other way was just too too bad. So yeah, guys, this is it. We composed what was missing the guitars. We we stabilized the song. So the song is now more or less, it's more or less, the shapes are there. Next time we're going to do the bass. We're going to do the bass. I already have the, the bass, which we can put down right now. So it was ample sound. Okay. We can even we can go away. We can go away. Let's yeah, and we're gonna add a distortion onto it. So sure. Let's look for the the same distortion we used on the guitar. There. And let's hear how it sounds. Not that good. now okay for now it works we'll see how it sounds with with the guitars and all this and yeah kind of like it it's not gonna be you though it's probably you yeah it is you oh but you're the same as there yeah ah, doesn't matter so yeah this is gonna be the base damn it this is gonna be the base and that's what we will do next Thursday Tuesday next Tuesday at 7 p.m. I'll be here again. So, starting another week, same as last week. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. 
always at 7 p.m. UK time. If you want to see how the song develops, come back. I'll be here. Okay, guys. Thank you for the new followers. Thank you for being here. Thank you for your patience. Thank you for your support. Hope you guys have a good one. Hope you guys have a good week. And I'll see you next Tuesday. Okay, guys. Have a nice Sunday. Have a nice week. I'll see you then. Bye-bye.